Another cool function to take advantage of is Google Earth, um, which the line between Google Earth and Google Maps has kind of melded over the years. These do be two very separate products, but not so much anymore. So right now, this is just the Google Maps that you're used to, but here in the corner, you'll see Google Earth. So you click that, and then that brings up a bird's eye view of wherever you are in this case in New York City. Isn't that nice? Now that's cool enough uh, to go and see this kind of like satellite imagery, which is kind of 3D in effect. If you see that building there, notice how you see different angles of it, very cool. Um, but if you use, see this icon that looks like the Windows logo on its side, that's the tilt the view view. So you click that and you can actually do it again and get even flatter. And then you kind of are uh, given this sort of like fly through Superman angle. You can just kind of fly through buildings or around trees or wherever you happen to be. And then go back. So that, yeah, go back there through that. There you go. And it's very cool. Now you have to give it a second to render so then you can kind of see and you can zoom in and out. And the more you let it render, the better details you'll have. But for now, we're just going to like fly through the city. You can kind of even see the cars and stuff down there from the satellite imagery. And if you zoom out, it just kind of looks like a very surreal Matisse painting. So sometimes it's very detailed. Um, but other than that, you can just fly through the exterior like that, which I think is really cool. Uh, so there you go. You can be Superman or an omniscient ghost who's everywhere and yet nowhere. Enjoy.